What a plot twist. And I'm not talking about Kiriha at the end. That was kind of crazy too about how she he respected Mibu's swordsmanship so much that he was willing to fucking try to kill her. Remember when he used the magic sword? But I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about Erika. About somehow she's from like the... What is she from? Like the Chiba family or some shit? Like her sword style apparently mirrors Mari and she's supposed to be some super OP person. It looks like our group of just weeds are pretty special. Every one of them, huh? Let's begin today's reaction. Oh shit, it's his vision again. Crazy shit. We saw this last episode. How does he do it? I don't know. Hmm. Maybe the older brother of the captain? Yeah? Her Highness? <laughs> He's a bit of a siscon too. Wow. Now, can he actually fight though? <laughs> Die. <laughs> Immediately end it. I'm not gonna listen. I'm gonna scare them a little. Miyuki, use your ice attack and just let them all have be uh, frostbitten. What's absolute power then? Guns? I mean, if we took a bullet, we would probably just die, right? That's a sign? That's a sign, maybe? What do the mines do? Jamming? Maybe jamming. <laughs> Evil eye. Consciousness interference. It's just like a genjutsu? How, how the fuck? How the fuck did you even break that shit down after one look? Bro, you are insane! Manipulation. Brainwash. Yeah, it was a party trick. Oh, he did that? I didn't see that. Well, that's the thing. No one can just do that. But Onisama is just so perfect. It doesn't matter. Damn. Yep, immediately. Wait, that's not ice. Who was that? Who was that? Tatsu did that too? I didn't realize I could just do that. Oh, okay. Not so cool anymore. <laughs> when your leader runs off screaming like that, it's over. The team morale is done. Look at this shit. They're all so scared. <laughs> and Muke is about to freeze them all. Y'all better fucking surrender. Oh, you idiot. You fucked up. You fucked up. Nah, you fucked up. <laughs> Enjoy the frostbite, dummy. Ugh. Ugh. Like, this is some next- Oh, if he shatters! Wait, don't you die? Okay, I thought he shattered for a second. Uh oh I mean, I've been asking for this. I wanted to see Miyuki in action. Big AoE ice. This shit is busted. Because Tatsuya did say, Miyuki, you don't need to be like him. You can just defeat them with absolute magic. I don't know what Nivreheim means, but she has OP AOE ice. And I'm sure no regular human can just do this, right? At most, they can probably try to do one single person. But she can cast it in like a huge area? Is that why she's so special? Oh, damn! Jumonji! I'm surprised he's not walking like this. Wouldn't it be so funny if you? Oh, let's go, Kitty Hara. But it'd be so funny if Jumonji had a shield up and was just going like this the entire time. I really underestimated Kirihara. Maybe it's just because they're all getting compared to Onisama, right? But goddamn, Kirihara's cool too. I mean, even last episode, people like Morisaki and everyone, they were popping off. There are very competent users, you know, just when I compare it with Onisama, it's not fair. That vision's OP. It's unfair. What is he truly doing there? I don't know. He's like shooting some kind of wave and it just completely deconstructs the weapon. What? What is that? What is that gonna do, bro? What? Oh, everybody's using their rings! Ho ho! But like, he doesn't really use magic, right? Tatsu doesn't really use magic like that. Would, would that affect him? How do you even know this, bro? How do you even know this, bro? Taijutsu. Ooh. Wait. This isn't Taijutsu. Wait. Huh? Because this isn't magic? What the fuck was that? That was like laser beams. Kirihara. Hara. 
This dude Kiriata looks way too fucking cool right now. Big bro. <laughs> he is big bro. I call him big bro too. Fuck him up. That's right. He did that to Mibu. Fuck him up. Uh-huh. Yes. Cut his arms off. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, shit, he did. Oh, he did. <laughs> he deserves it. I don't think it has to do it. <laughs> Jimonji, fuck him up, too. Jimonji, fuck him up, too. Come on. Ah, he's, he's not as petty as me. I would have gotten one more punch in, man. Anticlimactic? Yeah, I mean, the kids have to do everything. Like, where the fuck were the teachers, right? The high school students. These are like 16-year-olds. Jumonji is... No shot! Jumonji is under the age of fucking 35. This man, someone ID this dude. But, like, this world so far. Where the fuck were the teachers? Nowhere. Like, now the real-life authorities show up. But, like, during the entirety of last episode. It's these 16-year-olds that solved everything. Then again, it's anime. Why am I surprised? Mm -hmm. What you worried about? Is she worried that she fucked him up with her eyes so much? <laughs> Good, they deserved it. Muke is frightened by her own powers or what? I'm proud of you. You should torture them more. Yes, yes, Muki. Good, good. I mean, it's not even her fault anymore because she got brainwashed. I just want Kitty Hara to show up and, you know, help her out. Oh, what if that basket is from Kitty Hara? Not Tatsuya. Oh, oh, finally, some adults are showing up. Who is this dude? Some butler looking dude. Hayama. Is he from... Hmm. Yotsuba! Yotsuba! The ant! This is our true family? How does this work? Oh my god, she's a milf. Oh my god, the ant is a milf. Oh, please. So someone from the Yotsuba family is Miyuki's guardian. It's me. Mibu should be- Kirihara and Mibu! Oh, it's happening, bro. <laughs> it's just crazy because he fucking tried to use a magic sword to cut her down. We're gonna really just forget about that? I don't care if he said, you know, I was truly passionate. I care so much about Mibu's swordsmanship, but it's so funny. I'm glad that they're getting along now. Yeah, we said we'd come celebrate. More adults. Who are you? Oh, shit. Yeah, 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 pay money. You know, if you're truly thankful, give me money. This is just a bunch of lip service. And Kirihara. Onisama is so perfect. Onisama is so humble. Yeah, he justified everything that Mibu was doing. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. You know, this is just lip service. Pay me money. Kazama. Who? Who, who, who? Who? Major Kazama. These are like military terms. Military terms. Even in episode one, before anything happened, there was a bunch of random military scenes. I had no idea what was going on. Is Kazama the man that's guardian of Miyuki? Yo, why are you trying to push them together? Kitty had us here. What the fuck? I mean, yo, come on, come, come on. Why are you doing Kitty had this dirty? I agree. In terms of everything, I think Tatsuya wins. Come on. Erika, you trying to get with Kitty Hara? What, what the, what the fuck? Who is she cheering for right now? Oh shit. Oh, yeah, she's blushing so much. Oh my god. Miyuki. Miyuki, where's. I wanna see Miyuki's face. Oh! You can't confess! You're cucking Kitty Hara! And Miyuki's gonna be upset. No, this is adoration, right? This is admiring someone. Mm. Yeah, it's a bit unfair. Only someone's too perfect. No one can catch up to him. Miyuki. Damn, it's just getting a little too real. This is all on you, Erika. You started this. Ah, oh, he's so normal and average. So I bet I bet I could keep up with him, so I love him. <laughs> what are you truly saying here right now? Kirihara is so average and mediocre and normal like me, so I'm gonna choose him. Aw, oh, thanks. Thanks, Mibu. Makes me feel really great. You know, I'm not perfect like Tatsuya, but fuck it. I'll take that. 
<laughs> this fucking girl, Erika, is a demon, bro. Stop prying into this shit. Mm. Oh, Nisama saving the fucking day again. Oh, remember what he said? He admired her swordsmanship so much. Ah! <laughs> Tatsuya, so perfect. Hmm. Erika likes gossiping, huh? I'm actually so into even this like random slice of life shit going on with this character. Like I barely knew Kirihara and Mibu, but this is fun. Miki, don't worry about it. I never felt that way about her. Let's go. Look at that side eye from Tatsuya. Hmm. Miyuki can keep Miyuki can keep up with Tatsuya. Maybe this is some kind of metaphor. Follow. The only person capable of keeping up with Onisama. Mm -hmm. This fucking soundtrack, man. This is the incest soundtrack. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. I'll be reaching for you, middle sister. No, not when you're here with me, little sis. Oh! But then, I can't go to school with you, Miyuki. Come on. Yes, everything so that we can keep our incestual day to day at school together. Let's flex on all these peasants how much love we are in. Mm, this ordinary life. It's not very ordinary, but you know. It's a little peaceful times. With you. Keyword. Onisama! <laughs> Old hands? Oh shit! <laughs> this isn't. I mean, I shouldn't be surprised at this. It's just because, you know, how we saw Dream Boys are realists recently, and they ended it with the, you know, hand holding, but they do it so casually. And that's the episode. Post credit scene? Is this a different school? Oh, that's a lot of blood. Oh. Uh, oh, 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 okay. This is some super OP dude from a different school. Masaki. He looks pretty OP. I don't know about George, but, you know, Masaki. Damn, they think there's a lot of fan service of Masaki. Huh? You're talking as if descendants of the Ten Master. Yeah, and Jumonji. Jumonji and Chiba? Chiba? Erika, right? Are they the two descendants? No, no, you haven't met Onisama. Damn, what the fuck is this fan serve? The Crimson Prince? Well, Onisama's got a rival, maybe? Looks like we're setting up for the next arc. The Crimson Prince, Masaki. They're kind of hyping this guy up, but come on now. He, how the fuck is he gonna fight Onisama? Onisama is like too perfect. You saw what he did the last couple episodes. It's I think people have been saying there's like a tournament arc. And the fact that they're introducing another school makes me think we're going into a tournament arc, aren't we? Oh shit. Oh, and then it's gonna be like Tatsuya versus the Crimson Prince. Oh fuck. Oh dude, this is gonna be so good. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.